In today's episode, we will learn more assembly programming commands. Simple program that will permanently illuminate the green LED diode. The program contained in the external program memory is not different from the one that would be in internal memory. The simplest code from the episode 4 could be saved to the Abram memory via memory programmer. The ADC31 processor has no internal program memory, so using Abram 27C64 is necessary. Of course, you can use a different memory capacity, but 27C64 I have at hand. We will modify the program code letting the LED to learn new commands. The previous set of instructions, the current set of instructions, both programs do exactly the same. They light the green LED permanently. Entering the value 0 in the register P1 on the first position this time was done for using the MOV command. MOV means move and it moved the bit or byte from the place marked as source to destination. In this code, MOV P1 hash 1111110V destination is the 8 bit port register P1 and the source is the binary number 1111110. The number with the hash mark means that it will be entered directly in the register. Of course, you can convert a binary number 1111110 to hexadecimal F, E, or decimal 254. Bus, commands, M, O, V, P1, hash 1111110, binary. M, O, V, P1, hash F, E, hexadecimal, mob P1, hash 254 means the same. Entering a number in the register P1 will set the bit P1.0 to the logic state 0, bit P1.1 to logic 1, bit P1.2 to logic 1, and the rest of the bits also high. Y1111110 B and not 0111111 B. In our case it is data, 7590 FE020003 is data, means the compiled code of our program, 71 is a checksum, a kind of file correctness mark, 
The second line is the standard end of the file. Each hex file ends this way, the next file that the compiler produces is LST, for example. The LST file is a listing of assembler code, along with line numbers and addresses. This is the information you need to rebuild the program code. I will now analyze the signals from the address and data bus. The signals are recorded using the Celi logic analyzer. The ALE signal is the moment of address latch. The PSEN signal is the moment of reading data. Data and addresses registered when the power was turned on. Data and addresses transcribed and collected.